how do you reopen a closed print in Jira? It's very simple. So, hello everyone. How are you all doing today? This is your girl, Karen from Mafo, your Aja Evangelist. And welcome back to my channel. Today, I would like us to touch on something really quick in Jira. As a Scrum Master, there will be times when you will close out a sprint in Jira and uh, for some reasons you would want to reopen that sprint. Whatever your motive is, some people struggle with identifying how to go about that. So today I'm going to be showing you how to reopen a close sprint in Jira. It's very quick, it's very easy and I hope this video will be valuable to you. So please stay tuned and watch to the very end. Well, before we do that, I also just want to quickly say that, you know, we already actually started a Jira series and then for some reasons, because of other priorities, we paused that. So we are picking up on that again and I'm so very excited. So if you have not subscribed yet to this channel, please do, because we'll be posting a lot of valuable content on this channel, which will not be available on our main channel. This is our backup channel, Being Agile Consulting Remix. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do also turn on that notification bell, okay? So that you will always be reminded when new videos are uploaded. Now let's get into the point. I'm just gonna quickly share my screen. Um, all right. So how do you reopen a closed print in Jira? It's very simple. So the first thing you wanna do is to access your Jira. This is our Jira board right now. And then the very next thing you want to do is you select the project. If you come to this tab here where it says project at the very top, you, you click on it and then you select whatever project the, the, you, you want to work on. That is it for me. And then the very next place you go on the left hand side, select reports. Once you select reports, you will see the different reports that you have, you have earlier configured. So you select sprint burn down chart. There may be different ways, but let's just focus on using this one approach right now. Once you select sprint burn down chart, the very next thing you want to do is go to the sprints that you want to reopen. If you click where it says sprints right here, if you click on this little drop down button, it will show you all the close sprints, right? Once you have all the close sprints, you click on the sprints that you're trying to reopen. Once you click on the sprints that you're trying to reopen, that is it right here. This is the sprint. We are trying to reopen sprints um, one. Come to this little three dots right here. Click on this little three dots. You see, it says reopen sprints. Click on reopen sprints. It will ask you that, it will give you all the details. Four issues will be moved back to the sprints you're reopening. Okay, subtasks are not included in the total above and are always included in the same sprints as the apparent issues. Okay, um, so what do you have to do now? Click on reopen sprints. And ta-da! See, our sprint has been reopened. So from here, you can do whatever you want to do. If you need to edit something, if you need to add whatever information, whatever you need to do. You see, you do that and then that's it. And then once you're done with it, you can now close the sprint again. Let's say we're trying to add one more story and whatever you're trying to do, I'm not sure what your goal is. So once that is done, all what you have to do is come to this place that says complete sprints. You click on it and you complete the sprint again. It's closed back. Well, that's it for today. I hope this video was helpful. But before I go, I want to remind you that our upcoming training for Scrum Masters starts on the 4th of July. So if you have not enrolled yet, enrollment is already ongoing. Please do. Ah, just starting your journey. For me, Scrum certification is, is really just like 10% into the whole journey. So if you are looking for end-to-end -end support until you finally land your job and support on the job, we also have a fantastic package that covers all that. Okay, we have a fantastic package that has been designed to cover all that. Please 
check our contact information right there on the screen. Give us a call, send us an email, and we'll give you the details end to end on how to get started in this career path. We will hold your hand until the finish line. You don't want to miss that. We've helped thousands of people already. Our results speaks for itself. So I don't want to sit here and talk too much. Okay. But if this is something that you're passionate about, and well, maybe you don't even have direction yet, and you're just looking to be orientated and learn more, we'll be happy to provide that guidance to you. And for those that are looking to be agile coaches, maybe you're already working as an agile coach, you're aspiring to be an agile coach. We have also launched a fantastic agile coaching mentoring program. And at the end of that program, you earn a certification of participation. You gain insightful skills on how to succeed as an agile coach. And we also help you with interview prep, real life interview um, um, in questions and answers and guide you through the process of, you know, how to go about your interviews and succeed in learning that job and, and just thrive. So our next session also is already ongoing. The previous batch was just fantastic. You don't want to miss out. Please contact us and we'll be more than happy to hold your hand and guide you through growth in this career path. You don't have to stay a Scrum Master if that's not what you want. Some people want to remain a Scrum Master. Not everyone wants to be a coach, okay? But if coaching is something you have been thinking about and you don't even know how to go about it, you don't even think it's possible, that is a great path for a career growth in this agile space. Contact us. We'll help you achieve that. We are really looking to duplicate so many of us. For me, speaking about myself personally, I'm looking to duplicate so many of me. I'm looking to duplicate so many of me. I just find fulfillment doing that. Okay, contact us and we'll be so happy to help you. Thank you so much and hope to see you in the next video.